Hey guys, Stargazer 1331 back once again, bringing you part 7 of the playthrough of Crash Twin Sanity. This time it'll, it'll feature Slipside Ice Capades, which I'm now back in the room where the Psychotron is held, and yeah, sorry for the craziness that happened in the last part. I just, I don't know, I was just completely lost track of, uh, of thought. This is the Psychotron, gateway to the infinite dimensions. Beyond our universe, somewhere between the 9th and 11th dimensions, lies the mysterious 10th dimension. Okay. And there we must go in order to confront the evil twins, steal the riches, and restore the oh, natural yeah. order of things with me on top. We require six power crystals in order to make the leap, and we have... Oh, four. this is hilarious. Let's see. That isn't enough! All is lost, <laughs> unless... I love how it took him like three seconds to figure Come that on. out. And he built a interdimensional teleportation device. That's right, an interdimensional teleportation device, and he took him three seconds to figure out that we need six, we have four, that doesn't equal each other. Oh my god. Alright, and another thing that, that was funny when he said steal the riches, in that cutscene I skipped, Part of it was that they were, they were saying they were, the twins were talking about the, what, the tenth dimension, but the other kind of dumber twins was like, and riches beyond imagination, and Cortex goes, riches? And then the smart one goes, riches? What's wrong with you? Always bringing up the riches. So now Cortex, Cortex is all about the stealing the riches now, apparently. But still, I just love it, but that isn't enough. All is lost. Ah, Cortex. Bastard you. Ah, uh, let's see. All right, here we go. Uh, this platform will take it directly up to that cave up, uh, up there, up there uh, near the top of the mountain. Now I know for a fact I'm gonna miss some gems in this level, so I might show them you in bits and pieces. I don't know because. You're kind of moving at one constant speed in the next upcoming level, so if I miss a gem, just don't. Um, uh, just, 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 just part of my mess, so to speak. Yeah, and pardon that too. Well, actually, you know, you don't have to. That was just me being an utter dumbass. And again, I'm being an utter dumbass. Ugh. Believe me, I am not a perfect gamer in the least. I'm good, but I'm not perfect. I tend to be very, very careless, and I either, and I either over, overshoot jumps or undershoot jumps. Most of the time, I overshoot jumps. Alright. There we go. That's a crash. And there's the world crate. And I hate it how the music is not screwing up. That's, that, that, that's kind of making me sad. There, to the sea, I tell you, our salvation floats upon the briny blue. We must reach Engine's battleship and quickly before it sets sail. But how? Think, Cortex, think! And then Crash uses the simplest and dumbest idea of all. Staring at his ass. In utter amazement. Okay. Sure, Dan. Just, 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 just short. Yeah, that was a gem I missed right there, too. Wow, oh, this is some sort of crap. And yeah, part of yeah, yeah, part of yeah, part of my mess, but I am going to miss a jam or two in this place. I just suck at getting them all in the pass.
Mulan Cortex. Ladies, excuse me, madam. Are those real? Mother? Sure, game. Just. Oh, the gem was up there. Wow. Okay. Right. Oh, okay, I, I, I see how it is, game. Freaking A. Man, I was doing so good, too. There we go. I think this is what you turn into Super Oh, God. Oh, God. Yes. I'm still temporarily invincible. Take that, game. Aw oh, man. Yeah. I'd rather die because I I, I wanna get that gem. Oh that luck on crash when he's falling. That's pretty hilarious. Aw, oh, come on, really? I wanna die. God, this is so screwy. What the? Oh my God! This is not even right. Okay, thank you. Yeah, no, yeah. Sorry for failing this badly, but I just really, really want to get that gem. There we go. Yeah, because the, the one plus times I have to come back here, the better. Freaking A. You know what? Eh. God damn it. Like, I'm always coming at that at, like, the wrong time to piss me off. Oh, uh, well, too late. Never mind. Yeah, fuck everything. <laughs> oh my god! Man, I just- I just can't fucking win. Oh wait, how does that work? Okay. There we go. Christ. Yes, I got it. In your freaking face, man. You can suck it. How the fuck I got it, but I got it. Ow. Really? Wow, I should have got that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, that should have been three gems. And here's the snowball. Roll of roll, snowball style. Ice, ice, it with no match for, for Grit's power. Ow. Alright, so, yeah, so, so I would have got four out of the six chance, that's not bad. I'm gonna hope before the cutscene you turn into a snowball, but yet in this cutscene you're you're still a snowball. Consistency, people. I've never been so humiliated. No amount of treasure could ever begin to compensate. Treasure? Uh, how the hell he survived that, I'll never freaking know. But, well, that well that about does it for slip slide ice capades. Now, what I'm gonna do is that um, is that I'm gonna I'm gonna go back and um uh, I might I might show you where the gems are, but I might not. So until 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 then um uh, see you next time on part eight, which will be the rest of gems and slip slide ice capades and also high sea hijinks. Until then, see you guys later. Hey guys, there is a thirteen thirty one back once again, bringing you part eight of of, of the playthrough of Crash to Insanity. Now for this, I'm gonna try to get the gems, although because I already have three of them, so I'm, so I'm halfway there.
stuff like that on the first tr on the first try of anything. So that said, um, uh, stay tuned for part nine, which will be getting the yellow gem of our slip side escapades and then high seas high drinks. Till then, see you guys later. <laughs>